My name is Gregory Martier with Springer Realty Group, and I'm your local real estate expert here on the main line. Please comment down below or click the subscribe button. Also hit that bell notification so you can get updated and notified on all the videos that we're putting out on the main line. You can call, email, text anytime. We'll be glad to help and answer any questions. Maybe you have a certain question of an area we didn't cover, or maybe there's a particular property you want us to tour for you. We're glad to do it live. We'll, we'll make a video of it. Come to, uh, to visit inside. The Art Center has a diversified course offering. Wayne Art Center has a lot of great things for, for, all, for, for all kinds of folks, both amateurs and pros, for families as well. You can even rent out the place. I'll just take a quick spin around. Uh, I wanna point out the Radnor Trail here, which is actually runs along the old train station, uh, the old uh, train tracks, I should say. It's two and a half miles in Radnor Township. You can walk your dog here. There's little spots to, to kind of uh, take a break. There's uh, benches uh, along the trail. Uh, great little spot. It's very well maintained and it's very popular here. And one of the great stops is the Wayne Art Center. So minutes from downtown Wayne are, are, is a great park just like this. This is, uh, this is Odoricio Park. Perfect for sledding in the wintertime. It's got a, a soccer field. You could you could just kind of sit at, sit around. It has a, a basketball court here as well. This is a great little expansive space. Nice little spot to have a picnic. You can kind of sit, chill out in the park with the family, throw the frisbee. Thanks for checking it out. All right, everybody. It's Gregory Martz here. Uh, we're still in Wayne. We're in downtown Wayne on Wayne Avenue and Lancaster Avenue, right on the corner. This is the heart of Wayne. We've got quaint little shopping, great little places to eat. This is very walkable. There's a lot of spots in town you can walk to, but right behind me is the iconic Wayne Anthony Theater. They play box office hits here, but it's a, it's a cool little spot to go. A lot of history in this building. We're gonna take a walk uptown, come and join me. I have to show you this stop right here. This is one of the this, this piece of stone here has a lot of history. It's telling you 13 miles to Philadelphia. This was a part of a horse, uh, horse trail. So here's downtown Wayne, right behind me. I'm gonna take a walk up here. We'll visit one of the shops. I stopped here right on Wayne Avenue at a really popular spot. It's called the Goat's Beard. That's my impression of a, of a goat. They have bold, sustainable food, whiskey, and craft beer. Mm. All the food here is locally sourced. They've got a really great global cuisine here, too. They've got an extensive whiskey collection. <laughs> Everybody's saying hi. Say hi, everybody. They've got an extensive whiskey collection and a really relaxed atmosphere. They've got a great places to sit outside. This is the perfect day for, for maybe a light refreshment and a quick meal. Right across the street, you have the Matador, another popular spot. Take a quick video of it. This is a really cool place, downtown Wayne. Stop on by, be happy to buy you a drink. All right, so come with me. Let's check out some of Wayne's real estate. Behind me is Norwayne Condo. A one bedroom condo here will run you about $150,000. The two bedrooms run around 200,000. The HOA fee includes water, sewer, trash, and heat, which is great for budgeting. This is the excellent price point here. Really good value for your money. Really close to downtown, shopping, and, and other of Wayne's amenities. Great little off, offshoots of, of the main drag here. Uh, single homes will run you about, a, about a half a million, 500,000, between four and 600,000. Three and four bedrooms, two full baths and a half, finished basements, you've got off-street parking, you've got garages, you've got driveways, you've got yards for the kids. There's actually a fixer-upper on this block, right in the high threes, low fours. Uh, and the taxes here are very reasonable, right around $7,000 for the year. So this neighborhood is in historic South Wayne, technically. We've got Radnor Schools and Treddy School District best in the nation. 
I wanted to stop in one of these classic Wayne neighborhoods. This is in the heart of Valley Forge. Valley Forge Park is not far from here at all. It's still a Wayne mailing address. You still got the great school district. You're still very close to downtown. Uh, it's not walkable again, but it's excellent, excellent location. A typical house in a neighborhood like this is a five bedroom, three bath, around 3,600 square feet, two car garage. It'll run you right around the mid 600 level, between six and 700,000. Typical house in this neighborhood will run you around six or 700,000 in the mid sixes. These houses have a one acre lot which gives you that great neighborhood feeling, that suburban feel, but real close to downtown Wayne. And as we saw before, only about 13 miles from Center City, Philadelphia. So one of our last real estate stops here in Wayne is Chesterbrook. Very desirable, great townhouses. They've got one of the best run HOAs in the entire county. Uh, there are condos in here. But the townhouse, your typical townhouse is a three bedroom, two and a half bath. There are some with four bedrooms, two full baths, two and a half baths, uh, finished basements. You've got a clubhouse. You've got a ton of great amenities here. And for right around the $500,000 price point, it's the best bang for your buck in Wayne. Now you're not walkable to downtown Wayne or the train, but it's a quick car ride, 10 minutes or, or grab an Uber or taxi or something. So Chesterbrook is where it's at. You've got a 19087 zip code. Excellent school district, perfect location, great value. So I hope you enjoyed our video tour of Wayne, both downtown, South Wayne, historic area. It has so much to offer. Wayne has tons of new construction from estate homes in the two and two and a half million dollar range. And there are luxury condos available too, just under the million dollar mark. No expense has been spared. Three bedroom, two and a half baths, almost 3,000 square feet. Excellent choice for new construction right in, right, in, right in the main line. They even have walkable new construction, right? Just over the million dollar price point, a million two, a million three, single homes, off street parking, garages, full basements, and walkable right to downtown Wayne. Wayne has a definite elegance to it, but it also remains a down-to-earth community. Downtown Wayne has the, those boutique stores as well, and a lot of the fine dining restaurants actually set crystal out for their tables. One of the last things I wanna mention here is the Wayne Music Festival, which happens every year. It's typically the second Saturday in June. The event attracts more than 10,000 people People come from all over the country to see and to play. There are many, many music genres there. The music festival highlights both local and regional acts. There are tons of restaurants and tons of vendors at the festival as well. Thanks everybody for visiting. I appreciate it very much. My name is Gregory Martier and I'm your local real estate expert here on the main line. Please subscribe, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, click that bell notification so you can be notified of all the great videos that we have coming up. You can call and email and text me or comment down below anytime and I'd be happy to answer any questions you have about real estate. I want to be your go-to expert. Thanks so much for visiting and have a great day.